Alright, hey everyone, what's going on? Benarak here, and I bring you guys commentary over Modern Warfare 2 Team Deathmatch on Invasion. Uh, the final score is 22 and 8, I believe. Uh, let me double check that for you real quick. Uh, yep, 22 and 8. Uh, I was using the UMP 45. Uh, eight, or not ACOG. Um, what's it called? Holographic. And my sidearm was the M93 Rafika. 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 So many different ways of saying it. I don't think anyone really knows which way is right. Um, so yeah, it's pretty good gameplay. Uh, gonna talk about it a little bit, not not too too much, but I mean, yeah. Here's a little tip right here. Um, let's see, once I go prone, I could tell that guy from up there was shooting me, so I just burst fire him and get a headshot with I think three bullets from the UMP45. Um, I like this gun. I know it's really cheap sometimes, but it's it does shoot technically. I believe it shoots a pistol around the 45 caliber bullet. Um, so I mean, I guess you could call it a fully automatic pistol if you wanted, but maybe it should just be under the uh, machine pistols category. Leave a comment what you think. But no, I'm just joking. Um, so if the audio quality is not too great on this video, uh, oh, excuse me, oh, tired. Um, if the, sorry if the audio quality isn't too great. Uh, I'm just using the computer default mic. I uh, didn't really feel like plugging in my headset right now. It's just didn't feel like plugging it in. Uh, it's sitting right there, but then I gotta change the audio feed, and it's just. It's just kind of annoying, so I just thought, what the heck, I don't think they, anyone that watches it mind. Uh, I mean, if you really mind, leave a comment, and next time I'll use the other mic. Um, not much I can do now, I guess. Um, leave a comment, uh, I'm probably going to be doing another setup video later. Uh, probably right after this video, actually, I'll be doing it. Um, uh, my setup has changed a little bit, I've moved things around gotten some new games but besides that I mean I still got the same TV same Xbox um, so yeah that's another reason I love the UMP it's got great hip fire accuracy um, what else is there though I mean this is the second time I had to do this commentary because I did it a minute ago but the um, for some reason it was trying to record, I'm using my Apple headphones, and it was trying to record from that mic. Um, so that kind of, it's kind of disappointing. I got all done, I'm like, alright, I can listen to this real quick, make sure it's good. And, uh, they had nothing recorded, and it was a pretty good take of it. Um, so yeah, I shouldn't say, this is just kind of random, I shouldn't say I only used the UMP this game. I did use a ACR for a little while that I picked up. Uh, I hadn't unlocked it at the time of this match, but since then I have unlocked it, so yeah. Um, I think I was going to talk about was Team Nightfire a little bit, and my channel, uh, Team Nightfire, if you watch like any of our videos, we talk about it a little bit, because anyone that watches any of our videos, we, don't know, we want them to know what it is. Um, we have a podcast up on a friend's channel. Uh, next episode will go up somewhere, either his channel or this channel, probably. Um, but I'll put a link to that in the description, probably. You can guys can go listen to it. Uh, eventually, we'll put it on iTunes. But I mean, I made the RSS feed and everything, so it's just got to get copy and pasted, and bam, we're done. But. What else is that going to talk about? Oh yeah, uh, basically I'm going to be posting more stuff on this channel now. Uh, posting this on Team Nightfire. And my personal channel, Benarek. <sighs> Excuse me, Benarek96. Uh, I'm not really going to be posting as much there anymore. I really want to get Team Nightfire up and going. And then maybe get some people, or not some people, maybe get my channel, then work on it. Um, make sure that I'm paying enough attention to both channels. Because, I mean, I've, I enjoy doing this stuff. I mean, I don't have an HD PVR, but, I mean, 
I can render 720p video. I know it's not the same as HD PVR, but I mean it's still good enough. That I mean I don't have like dazzle quality because I mean dazzles are just like they're just not very good. They have really if you try to uh, undo stuff, it just messes everything up and. Uh, I use Sony Vegas for my editing, so it's easy for me. Um, a lot of people say that Sony Vegas is complicated, and it's a lot of keyboard shortcuts, and it is a lot of keyboard shortcuts. But once you learn them, it's really easy. Um, I'm not a huge editor. I mean, I'm working on my montage of my own. Uh, I was mess. Sometimes I'll mess around. I'll download some clips and edit them and stuff, but. I don't know, I just have more fun doing commentaries and stuff. Not as much montages. Um, but... I mean, whatever, everyone likes their own thing. I know a lot of people just get an HD PVR to do montages, but personally... I mean, I don't have as much fun doing that. Uh, one... I don't get clips that often to upload a ton of montages. And two, they just take... a fairly decent amount of editing once you get the clips. Um, killed him with the last bolts from the Rafika. Um, also known as the Mini M16. Because it's, it's basically an M16, but pocket sized. Um, also, I might go paintballing soon. Um, let me know if you want to see some video of that. I'll strap a camera to a paintball gun, maybe. Uh, should be pretty cool. I've seen a lot of YouTubers doing that lately. Um, so I'll do some videos of that if I go. I'd love to go paintballing. Yeah, I've been once. But, I don't know, maybe I'll just get a paintball gun so I don't have to rent one. Ah, uh, they're not all that expensive to buy. Which is about 200 bucks for a decent one. Um, they're not like airsoft guns where there's ones that are absolute shit and then there's ones that are really good uh, pretty much they're all gonna shoot the same it's a lot of just looks and durability to me that's what I've noticed it seems like uh, I was looking at I think a Tipman and US Army one US Army one looks like a fucking M16 and another tip right there the double Y to cancel your reload um, I'm not good at it with snipers to like cancel the bolt action you have to time it just right and stuff but what else to talk about? A couple minutes left in this commentary. Uh, like I said, found score was like 22 and 8. Um, here I pick up another ACR. This gun is just a god gun, man. I mean, it's just so accurate. And a lot of people complain about the damage, but if you don't have much kick. Then you can just keep the trigger held down. And it's not that big of a problem for me with damage. Um, I've tested it a couple times. It seems to me it takes about. Uh, it depends on where you're shooting them, but like five to six bullets to kill them. Or I guess I should say not three to five usually. If you hit them every time, but usually you're gonna miss a couple shots, but. And then, here's another quick tip, uh, you can use your equipment while going up a ladder, and then double tap X, or click it to kill him, or detonate it. So, yep, 22 and 8, 22 kills, 8 deaths, and 1 assist to that game. Uh, found kill was pretty bad, with a ACOG intervention. But, yeah, that's game. Uh, please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you guys later. See you guys.